Right there. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. How you doing? Hi. <laughs> uh, if you are new here, thank you for choosing this video to watch. And if you're not new here, thank you for returning. I love you. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. I have been so hot here. I mean, in my apartment, there is no AC. We recently just moved into this apartment. They don't supply us with an AC. We have to buy our own. And I guess we waited till the last minute because we were like, oh, well, maybe we would just get a fan. Like, that'll be good. We got a fan, guys. It is so morbidly hot in here. It is crazy like so i don't know if you guys can see it on camera but i'm like shiny it's it is bad but you know i was like let me do this video like i gotta get a video done i haven't done one and here we are but before we get started i want to just remind you guys that if you guys have not follow me on instagram please do so and subscribe it really helps me out thank you okay i got this guy and i think I, i've just started getting them I got my boxy charm in the mail and I decided to do a video on everything that I got because I feel like a lot of people don't know what boxy charm is. Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Okay, sorry. Um a lot of people don't know what boxy charm is and like what they offer and they think it's it's like Ipsy and it is, but it's not. Like the stuff here I feel like you get more for your book rather than with Ipsy. So I figured I'd show you guys like what I got, make do a look with it and just chat with you guys a bit. So, as you can see though, let's just let's just show this. I got my nails done, my eyebrows are done. I was looking like a homeless rat for a bit, but now I'm back to normal. And you know what? Cheers to that, let's take some water. Look, my water is sweating. Jesus. With that being said, let's get started. Let's talk about the stuff that I got in the BoxyCharm. Now this is my June box. I mean, if you don't know what BoxyCharm is, BoxyCharm is a beauty subscription that charges you $25 a month and you get five full-sized beauty items. So you can get skincare treatments, makeup. Now they have a quiz that you do, which I think is really fun. And then you get to select what you like and what you don't like, which I think is really fun as well. So I like to get more makeup stuff because my face stuff I like to do on my own. So how it works is they'll charge you on the first, right? And then they ship it like a week afterwards. So I always end up getting mine like in the middle of the month. I have been getting BoxyCharm now for about three months. Like I'm a new subscriber. This is me using my own money. So everything that I'm gonna tell you is valid. I mean, for me at least. Uh, this has been my favorite month thus far. Like I feel like I got everything that I needed in one box. So I got this intensive eye care cream and um i need to look it up but because i don't use things with fragrances so if this doesn't have a fragrance in it there you go i was really contemplating on getting an eye cream i didn't know what to get so i'll definitely could try this out then i got these lip trio guys i have been using this so much since i got it these colors are so pretty i feel like they're like every color you ever need. We live for this. Then we got Lily Lashes Triple X Mascara, which is, I mean, I've never used it, so it'll be fun to see how this works out. Then I got a Laura Geller Multitasking Eye Lip Cheek Palette. It's a cream, eh, it's a cream to powder trio. Oh, the thing fell. But I swatched them a little bit to see. As you can see, that's like, that's like it so we're gonna use that today see how it works last but not least we got this bad boy this is the orange the philip orange palette by touch and soul so i was really excited when i got this because as you guys know i use touch and soul as my face primer like that is what i use to prime my face and the primer is absolutely amazing so i'm really excited to see how this palette is going to work out so without further ado, I already primed 
my face. I already did my mascara. and I mean my mascara. Jesus Christ. I already did my foundation and concealer. So we're going to just jump right into the stuff and see what look we can achieve. All right. So what color am I going to use from this palette to start off? I think I'm going to use this color Affogato. And that's this guy. I need to like keep the plate here to see the names. So I'm going to use Affogato. And I'm gonna use that as a base on my eye. Ooh, I love that. I definitely wanna incorporate that somewhere. That's the vibe. And I think I have orange like on my top so it'll work well. I'm gonna go ahead and do something with the crease. I'm gonna go with this brownie color right here for the crease. And that's the color Espresso. All right, now that's the crease. So far, these colors are blending really, really well. The little goes a long way, and I really, really like that. So, um, so far, I'm really not mad at this palette, and I really enjoy it. Now I'm gonna go with the outer corner. I really don't know what kind of color to use, because I, I, I need to fit this somewhere. Like, I don't care if I just, like, put it towards the end. Like, so, this has to go somewhere, because I gotta see what that does. I'm gonna go with the color Tarte that like ready color and I'm gonna put that again throughout the crease to kind of bring some color to it. Now I'm gonna do the outer corner. I like that color study break. I think that's this guy right here. I think I'm gonna put that in the outer corner a little bit. Right guys, I'm not mad at that at all. I think that looks really, really good actually. Now I'm gonna proceed onto the lid and for the lid, I really, really want to use this guy, brown sugar. That's not, that doesn't look like a brown sugar, but I'm going to use that guy right there. We have that on the lid. I feel like it made it, I don't know. I don't really like that that much on the lid, but it's already there. So I guess I can't really do much about it, right? I think it makes it look a little too, too natural for my liking. Um... You know what? I'm gonna put this color, Chiful, on top of it. So that's this guy right here. Okay, that was 10 times what I really like Chiful. Chiful and brown sugar mixed together. I mean, we've pretty much used every single color in this palette other than Milk Foam and Burt First Cafe. So what I'm gonna go ahead and do is go to the guest of honor which is caution hot that orangey one right there i'm really excited to use that and i'm going to put that in the tear duct of my eye all right i put that in i feel like i put too much in the tear duct but i'm not really that mad at it we're gonna go up now with the color but first cafe that big guy that we haven't used and i'm gonna put that at the bottom of my eye now i think I, that looks a little light and i can't really see it so i'm gonna go back with espresso i believe yeah espresso and then put that at the bottom last but not least we're gonna go in with the color milk foam that whiten i'm gonna put it at the top to kind of highlight my brow All right guys, and this eye is done. I really enjoyed this palette and I think it gives you a nice natural vibey look that I really go for. Especially with like a top like this, this would be a great look without the orange. Um, I did not like the orange pan that much. To me, it just wasn't it. I mean, it looks really pretty as a swatch, but yeah, it just didn't do like the greatest of jobs for me. Other than that, this might be one of my new favorite palettes. I really, really like the way it like settled everything and makes me look right like just chill. You know what I mean? Next, we're gonna proceed to the face. We got this bad boy to try out. I'm just gonna swipe my face, just clean anything that I have there. Now, I'm gonna start off with the contour and this is in, that's the color Coconut Grove. I normally use powder contours, so to, to do a cream contour is gonna be interesting. I've never done it before. I do a three. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead with the blush now So those are my cheeks. So far, I don't hate this, but I think I'll just stick with powder better. Next, I'm gonna do the highlighter. All right, I mean,
mean, it makes me look very dewy. Hmm, I don't know. I don't know if I like that that one that much. I, I don't like super hate it, but I don't super love it. Does that make sense? We're gonna proceed to the next thing, which is mascara. Ow! Holy fuck! <laughs> well, okay. I think it did not appreciate me talking about it like that, but we're gonna proceed to the mascara. Um, I'm not gonna put on lashes, I'm gonna try to do this eye just because there isn't much going on. So I'm gonna do this eye with my natural lashes. But this is the Lily Lashes Mascara. So I, I'm hoping that it works out really, really well. So I went ahead and put on like three coats. I'm gonna curl it and then I'm gonna put one more coat on because I don't have much. So let's see how that works. All right, now that mascara is really good. I don't hate it at all. I think that this was great, to be really honest. I'll definitely be using this mascara again. Now, we're gonna use my favorite thing out of the whole box, the lip. These are lip liners, and they are from Beauty Valute. It's the Cicardian, the Cicardian? I don't know if I'm saying that right. Cicardian, whatever. It's the Cicardian Trio. It's just such a good trio. It looks so good on. I, when I first got it, I was like, wow. And sure enough, it wowed me. I wanna try to use all three. I am gonna start off with the darkest one and that is Cozy Kiara. And I'm gonna use that to line my lips. We all know I love a good overline, so. Now I'm gonna proceed with Bew Babe to kind of just darken the inner a little bit. Now last but not least, I'm gonna go with Natty Nat. This is the, I haven't used this one yet, so I'm gonna use this one just to like darken the middle. Ooh. We love this. I'm gonna go ahead and set it. And I'm gonna use Touch and Soul setting spray, which is one of my favorite setting sprays. I like to add it on my body because it gives like a little shine shimmer that I enjoy. Yeah, guys, this is it. This is what I got in my monthly BoxyCharm box. I'm gonna start doing these once a month. I think this is really fun. This was a great box. They gave me everything that I needed, but sometimes they'll give you more skincare stuff, but I definitely will give you guys an updated box video every month if you guys are interested in seeing that. For the most part, I love this look. I love this lip. Guys, even if you don't get BoxyCharm, get this lip. This lip combo is good so creamy too i feel like i don't even need like gloss or anything i love it that's that's the vibe this whole video was fun guys if you again stayed this long and if you liked the video please comment like and subscribe it really helps me out i really appreciate it i hope you guys are staying safe now that things are opening up please remember to social distance i will see you guys in the next video i love you bye